Hey guys, how are you? It's Shonda. Welcome to my channel, Just a Little Glitz. So, um, if you're familiar with me, you know I have another channel, um, Shonda J. Um, 83. Um, but on this channel, I kind of just wanted to step away from the everyday things I was doing on the other channel and just focus on um, skincare and um, beauty products, makeup, accessories. So I decided to make this channel only for that. So if you're not interested in that, that's fine. You can go to my other channel and just um, check out all the other stuff I have with my dog, just me fooling around, you know, just, just a bunch of, you know, everyday nonsense. Um, but for this channel, we're just going to focus on um, basically beauty um, tips and beauty products and um, things of that nature. So first, I first thing I want to review is I'm not sure if you guys know um, of the Christian Dior um, clutch that he just put out. Um, can you guys even see that? Probably not. Holy smokes. Oh, there you go. This one. The gold one that he just put out. Beautiful. Now, okay. <laughs> I'm already going to say it. I already cheated, okay? I know in a review, we're supposed to open everything together and go through everything together. But this thing is so beautiful. I couldn't wait. Um, it's, it's a makeup um, pouch. You could personalize it if you wanted to. Um, I personalized mine and it comes with four lipsticks and you can actually take everything out and it turns into a clutch. Um, I, already, I already wore it. <laughs> I already wore it. I already wore some of the lipsticks. Like, I'm, uh, I'm guilty, okay? So this, this is a review of, of, of everything of what I've already like experienced, okay? It's beautiful. It's beautiful. It wears well. It's it's hardy. It's 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 like hardware. <sighs> buy it. Like spin the coins and buy it, okay? So we're gonna act like <laughs> we're gonna act like we're opening this for the first time, okay? But we're not. We're not. So this is how it comes. Beautiful, okay? Beautiful, okay? Gorgeous. And it's it's metal. It's hardware, okay? And when you open it, you had the option of getting your name. And I did. Honda, right there. And inside are four lipsticks. Absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. So, of course, I did already swatch them all. Like, I was so excited. I was so excited when I, um, when I got this in the mail, I just had to like put them on, swatch them all. I was just at the kitchen table like, oh, look, 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 look. I will say, look, I didn't do this. I didn't take the the um, tape off of here. So let's do that together. That's one thing I didn't do. How about that? We'll do that in earnest together the film over the mirror and it's like a real mirror guys a real big mirror well, I can't do it that way for that on troubles wow Is it supposed to come out? 
It's got a little tab here. Uh, -huh. but if you take it off, the Christian Dior comes off. Uh -huh. Maybe that's not supposed to come off. Uh, you gotta make a decision. Because if it comes off, the Christian Dior comes off right there. Okay, we'll take it off later. How about that? Okay. And then it comes with a chain. That's gold as well. I'm telling you, this is just a beautiful piece. And the little Christian Dior is on the side. And it just hooks right in. Like so. And once you take everything out, you can wear it as a clutch. And it does hold your cell phone. And, you know, I, I use my cell phone. And I think I had, like, my bank cards. And that was it. And, it, and nothing fell out or anything. And that's is a your cutie pie clutch isn't that gorgeous isn't that gorgeous yes it is yes it is so let's get into reviewing the actual lipstick okay okay guys so like i said you got four lipsticks that came with clutch one regular size lipstick and three miniature size lipsticks. Now, if you ask me, these lipsticks are, everyone can wear them, um, no matter what your skin tone is. Um, you might have to put a lip liner on to make the shade better for your skin tone. Or you might have to apply it uh, more gingerly, um, depending on your skin tone. But I think everyone can wear all four of these shades. When I tried them on, I was happy with all four of the shade colors. And I um, two of these shade colors are actually, I've been wearing them. And... Um, I, I actually really like them. Um, my favorite Dior lip color, and I'm so glad it came in the biggest one, is the 999. I have a hard time with reds, and I think this 999 is like an everybody red. Like, I don't care what your skin color is. I think everybody can wear this red. So, of course... Let's get to swatching. We got our Christian Dior wipes here. And we're going to swatch a little bit. Now, if you never tried, before we go, if you never tried the lipsticks, um, these are matte. Um, and I do have a little bit of gloss on my lips just because we're going to be swatching a lot. But the formula is very smooth and silky and nourishing, even though it's a matte. Um, and it's kind of has like a powdery finish, but you can really still like massage it into your, into your lips. It's not drying at all. Like the, like you'll have to really experience the the formula on your lips to to know what I'm talking about. It's it's really a beautiful finish. It's not drying at all. I I really like these lipsticks. Now as for the color, like I said, this 999 is killer. I don't care what your skin color is, you can wear this. So that's that on me, and you know I'm I'm fairly dark skin. I'm I'm dark skin, and that's it on me.
Now, that's me applying a lot. I don't apply this much. Um, I usually just apply one swoop, but I wanted to give you an honest, you know, sample of what the color looks like. Um, so if I were to wipe some of that off, I think that's how much I would put on just one swoop and that's how it would look on me and um, you know I would probably wear this at night because it's red just me personally um, I just don't wear red lipstick during the day not that there's anything wrong with it don't don't I'm not saying that there's anything wrong with it it's just that I don't wear red lipstick during the day um, and that's how it, it looks just like a nice fresh berry color um very pretty and like i said very nourishing powdery finish just just pretty it's just very pretty okay and like i said this that color is called 999 and it's um it's the biggest one and it's the full size lipstick Probably shouldn't have started off with red, huh? <laughs> oh, but it's coming off pretty good. Oh, these wipes are killer too, just to let you guys know if you're not up on them. These wipes are killer, especially to take off your eye makeup, like really nice. Okay, the next one is, um, color 720 and icon velvet now this color is like a springy color I would have just Put one swoop on like I said I don't put this much lipstick on um, but it's very pretty very pretty nice fresh looking healthy looking lips um, I, I think anybody could get away with this color I think this color would be a good color of a blush or um, eye color on anyone um, so, I think this is a pretty color too. Like I said, all four of these colors, I think anyone could wear if you put it on properly. Let's just wipe the top off. Put it in more. And there you go. Just a nice... Now, me personally, I would have put less of this on and added a little bit of gloss and it would have been a nice lip color for me. That's how I would have applied this lip color for myself. Okay. So, let's see our next, oh, I didn't swatch it for you. And that's color 720. If I know some people like to go by numbers instead of mess it on my skin tone. I know some people like to go by numbers instead of the name. Okay. So, this is color 100 and the nude look matte. This color, I would definitely need a lip liner with. 
like I said, some of these colors, depending on your skin tone, you're going to need a lip liner. This one, my skin tone, I don't feel like I can get away with nude lips. I just don't. They may look good to some people, but I don't feel comfortable with it. Um, I wouldn't mind wearing this if I had a lip liner on first, like a berry color or a brick color or something. And then put this over it. That's just me, in my opinion. Other than that, the color's not bad. But just to go out the house with this color on only, not my forte. Me personally. Some people can get away with it. I just don't feel like I can. So I'll swatch that for you. And that's the number 100 lip. And that's it on my skin tone. I just make, it just makes me look ashen. And I know that some people like that look, but I, I don't, I don't like it. Not on me. And like I said, like the formula is so silky, but it still has like a powdery finish. It's, it's very, the formula is beautiful. It really is beautiful. It's nourishing. Um, not drying at all. Even though there's no shine to it really, it's, the formula is really beautiful. It really is. And even after you wipe it off, like, like your lips are still nourished, like and not having a problem with my lips. And last is Classic Matte. Now this color I actually wore today. I like this color. I didn't put this much on. Like I said, some of these colors you're going to have to adjust to you. Yeah. But this color and the 999 have been my two favorite colors so far. I'm living for this color. I think it looks good on my skin tone. It's gone with like a lot of my makeup looks. Um, like I said, I don't apply it this heavy. I'm just applying it heavy so that you guys can get the actual look of it, the actual feel of the formula. But um, for me and my everyday makeup look, one is good enough for me. And then I just kind of rub it in. But this pink, you know, kind of, I don't know, bubble gum, I don't know, what do you want to call it? I don't know, not even like strawberry sorbet. Look, I really like it. I love it and I think it's, I don't know, I think it's a great daytime, everyday, you know, healthy, like shine from within lip color that everyone can wear no matter what your skin tone is this one in a 999 i love them definitely my two favorite lip colors from dior now i had a lip gloss on with this with my one little swatch and terrific terrific it's it's just it's just a pretty color it's a pretty color and I'll swatch that on my hand for you. And that's what that looks like on my hand. And again, this as a blush or an eye color, 
definitely, definitely a winner, no matter what your skin tone is. And again, the formula, the formula is good. Like, look at that. Formula is good. And it comes off easy. Like, it just slides right off. There's nothing on this um, cotton square. It's nothing on it. And I mean, even when I had the 999 on, I put that on first and I thought I was going to have trouble. <laughs> and I was like, why did you put it right on first? But they do come off easy. They don't tend to stain. And that's one thing I like too. So if it's your skin and you're like, oh no, I'm going to have red lipstick on. I'm going to have a stain. No, it's that they come off easy. And of course, you can always use the makeup remover if you need to. So, going back to the purse, I just want to show you, um, because I took the inside out, that it looks like this once you take everything out. And um, I don't have an extra cell phone here, sorry. But I just kind of like threw my stuff in here. I'll just throw the chain in there. You just throw your stuff in there, close it up. It'll sit up like this, no, like this. And then you'll wear it like that. I'll turn around. You'll wear it like that. And nothing falls out. Like, it's, you know, it stays closed. Um, definite great buy. Definite great buy. So. So, final thoughts about of this clutch is it worth the coins yes um first of all i went and put a little gloss on with a 999 just a little swatch and this is the way it looks i love it is this worth the coin is it worth the hype yes um two things you are getting four lipsticks by christian dior who doesn't want that you are getting a makeup case if nothing else if you don't want to wear it as a clutch you don't have to um, you're getting a makeup case that have a an actual mirror in it which I like I hate the ones that have like a little mirror or one of those like little fake flimsy mirrors this has an actual mirror mirror in it um, if you do want to wear it as a clutch you're getting a killer clutch um, that you can wear out on date night or just with a killer outfit. Um, I wore it with an outfit that was similar in color to this um, with a jacket and some tan shoes and it was just really cute. I got a lot of compliments on my ensemble today. And I had, you know, a lot of gold accessories to go with it. And I just got a lot of accessories. I mean, a lot of compliments on the way I looked um, when I was out today. So, I do think that it's worth the buy. Um, because, why not, right? You're, you're getting like three things out of it. You're getting and you're adding to your collection if, you, if you're into collecting Dior you're adding to your collection um, if you liked any of those colors you're you're adding to those those are the colors I don't know if you have those colors already if those are your favorite colors or if those are going to be new colors for you um, but those colors are going to be in there um, and yeah, so I do think it's worth the, the investment. I do think it's worth the investment. 
And of course, when we're buying luxury brands, we have to remember it is an investment. So we're going to take care of our investments, right? We're going to take care of this. We're not going to bang it around. We're going to put it back in the box when we're done with it. Um, we're going to take care of our lipsticks um, and things like that, you know, because we do have to spend a little bit of extra money on this type of stuff. So whenever we're buying things like this, we're going to say, hey, that's my more expensive, la la la, yada yada yada, whatever. And, you know, just treat it as, as that, as your more expensive piece, you know what I mean? And you'll always have it, you'll always have it, and you can treasure it. So, yeah, definitely treat yourself to this. Treat yourself to one of these or something else from that collection. Or maybe you're, you know, maybe you're not a Christian Dior girl, maybe you're somebody else but or a Chanel girl or something but right now we're doing Christian Dior so right now you're gonna be a Christian Dior girl how about that <laughs> how about that so definitely go out I bought I bought mine online I don't know if these are in store honestly because you have the option to get it um personalized and I know it's limited edition, so you might want to head over to the website. And don't forget to sign up so that you can get your loyalty points, okay? Don't don't skip out on those loyalty points because you want to start adding up so that you can get free samples and everything else like that. So emails and things like that don't be good, okay? So as always, thank you for watching. If you came over from the other channel and you're over here on this channel, thank you so much for following me. Um, say your prayers, say your affirmations, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.